Hi, this next section covers about 40 years of fishing for salmon. I have fished for salmon off the west coast of Vancouver Island, Washington off the coast and Oregon, and in the inland sea known as Puget Sound. And I've had my best success off the mouth of the Columbia River. We've had some great catches there. I had access to a boat run by my father-in-law, John, and it was a 42-foot boat called Sea Venture that has been in charter service many years. Uh, and then I had access to uh, another boat run by uh, my good friend Rob. It was a 21-foot sea swirl with uh, twin uh, downriggers. And we've had some success at King, Silver, and Pink Salmon in Puget Sound. Although Puget Sound has been very thin. And uh, Rob has gotten discouraged as of late because of the short seasons and the low runs. So he sold his boat. I fished for eight hours a day for four days straight off the west coast of Vancouver Island and uh, finally caught uh, the biggest silver I've ever caught. So that helped, but uh, that was in the last hour and the last day. Uh, we brought home some bottom fish too. But anyway, I had the opportunity to run into Jonathan Hillstrand of the Deadliest Catch fame, and I told him about my fishing off of the west coast of Vancouver Island. He says, yeah, growing up up in Homer, Alaska, we fished our brains out. And I can safely say I have fished my brains out for about 40 years here. I hope you enjoy this next sequence of images of my 40 years of salmon fishing. There's Skipper John with the Sea Venture out for maintenance. Our family on board the Sea Venture. Wayne and Fred out fishing on the Sea Venture. We were headed out of Ilwaco into the mouth of the Columbia out to the Pacific Ocean. There we are out on the ocean. Our catch of the day on ice. Another trip out on the ocean, and uh, we filled the box out that day. That was a great day. There's Wayne and Skipper John, uh, the Sea Venture, obviously, and uh, Wayne's catch of the day. Uh, another trip out. There's uh, Dennis on the right, and uh, Skipper looking down on us. I think this was the view he had, me looking up at him. And here's a big king that was brought on board. And a catch of the day, August 2nd, 2004, on our picnic table on our deck. This is the uh, Pacific Dream, a boat we toured on but didn't fish off of. Here's my family out fishing. That's Ashley in the foreground. And Angela, she caught a king that day. Beautiful fish. Another day of fishing out on the Pacific Ocean. Did I say we fished our brains out? We literally did, but we did bring home a lot of salmon. Alan up in the San Juan Islands fishing off a sailboat. We fed ourselves for about three meals off of that one. Dennis and, and Dan fishing up by uh, Port Townsend. This is the rigs we had up in the San Juan Islands, Ashley. Uh, we didn't catch anything that day. But Here's a morning on the Pacific Ocean, sunrise. Uh, there's a couple of the Club 60 guys, Dennis and Rick. Dennis. And Club 60, we were all 60, including the guy that took the picture. That's the guy that took the picture. That's his fish he caught that day. And somebody featured the uh, transom of the Sea Venture for their art. This is Rojo Caliente, a uh, fishing boat that we used in Puget Sound. This was Rob's boat. Here's fishing off of Merrill Stone Island, up by Point Mill Point, Port Townsend area. Here's off Edmonds from Captain Rob, Rob rather. Rob and Ray and a blackmouth brought on board, me and a blackmouth. That was some good fish. Ray and I on the dock at, uh, at uh, Shoal Shoal and some of our blackmouth that we caught. Out of Westport on a rough day with about 22 on a 40 foot boat, waves 6 to 10. However, we did catch fish. Rob caught the biggest fish, I think, of the group. He always seems to outfish me. That's Rob with a smaller fish. I had to make up for it on another day. Anyway, these were the uh, Westport fish that we brought home. So there you have it 40 years of fishing for salmon encapsulated. Actually, it's been 50 years. I'm getting older. 
So I gotta set my sights on New Horizons. I really have to. I'm thinking Alaska. There's more fish up there, I bet. Thanks for watching.